Hey Taurus, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing well. It's been a while. Um, I've just been really busy. I'm going to try and get back to doing regular uh, videos. So this is a general message. I hope it resonates. If it doesn't, it may just not be for you. Um, feel free to check out any up and coming videos. Right, let's get into it. Clear and accurate messages for the sign of Taurus, please spirit. What do I need to speak on? Clear and accurate messages for the sign of Taurus. Okay, death in reverse. What else, please? The Eight of Pentacles. The Devil card. Okay, interesting. All right, what else, please, Spirit? The Hermit. What else? The Chariot card. Right, I'll move these over once I've um, put them out so you can see them a bit clearer. What else, please, Spirit? What else for Taurus? Seven of Cups. What else for the sign of Taurus, please? Okay, Ace of Swords. Two more, please. <laughs> Showing up in your own reading, Taurus. The Hierophant. Nice. What else, please? Aha. And the Queen of Pentacles. Why am I not surprised? <laughs> Right, straight off the bat, some of you are grafting. Yeah, I see you with your head down. You're trying to master something. Some of you have gone back to study. That's what I see here. And for others of you, I just see you working on your your business endeavors. Some of you are really focusing on climbing the career ladder at this time. Taurus is a hard working sign anyway, so I am not surprised that the Eight of Pentacles is here. Um, Hmm, interesting. Yeah, and with the Hierophant here, some of you are teachers, leaders, in some kind of a managerial role. I see people looking up to you here. Some of you are mentors as well, counsellors. And again, you're getting to the bag, Queen of Pentacles energy. I'm going to read uh, the narratives I'm getting. I'm going to clarify, but straight off the bat, there's a lot here to do with work and leadership for you. There's also something that some of you are doing obsessively as well with the devil card. I feel like some of you are obsessed with your work and you're hermiting at this time. You're keeping yourself to yourself. And for others of you, I'll be honest, some people are jealous of you at work. Mm, you shine, Taurus. I get this sense of, um, yeah, the, the spotlight seems to be on you at this time. And some people, yeesh, <laughs> this energy, mm. The devil card some people are a little bit obsessed a little bit envious and a little bit jealous but those are side notes right let's get some clarity why is the death card in reverse please spirit why is the death in reverse okay six of wands what else okay these two wanted to come out so i'll take them both the High Priestess and the Queen of Wands is clarifying the Eight of Pentacles, exactly what I thought. Okay, why is the Devil here, please, Spirit? Thank you. Devil card here with the King of Pentacles. Why is the Hermit here, please? <laughs> Hermit's clarified by the Page of Pentacles. I'll let you know why I'm laughing in a minute, because everything that I feel I've said in the beginning is what's coming out. Spirit is clarifying exactly what I've been sensing all along. Okay, so the chariot card, that's clarified by the hanging man and the strength. What else, please, Spirit? Why the seven of cups? Aha. Okay, ten of cups in reverse. Ace of swords. Why is the ace of swords here? Four of Cups. Why is the Hierophant here, please? Yep. Excuse the background noise. Okay, so the Hierophant is clarified by the Six of Cups and lastly, Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, Seven of Pentacles. It's quite a straightforward reading. <laughs> Bottom of the deck, you've got the Queen of Swords. Okay. So... Let's give this a quick scan before I speak on it. All right, let's go. 
with the death card in reverse clarified by the six of wands some of you have had a really um, slow transition I feel like with the death card here there's been endings I feel like there's been some slow endings for people whether that's relationships have come to an end friendships have come to an end work situations have come to an end hmm there's a few cycles that have been completed here Taurus for you and I feel like this has either been a long time coming or it's taken a long time for you to um yeah close close these situations out interestingly enough it's clarified by the six of wands so I feel like you've you needed to do this or spirits guided to you to do this for your highest good in order for you to have the success and recognition that you deserve yeah some kind of admiration here um and recognition you've had to make some real changes to your situations in life yeah i hope that resonates it, it may for some of you here i am getting a real sense of success is is imminent or you are experiencing a period of of success recognition praise acclamation here but it's come as a result of closing out a painful past or painful situations yeah, your next card out is the ace eight of pentacles and that's clarified by the high priestess and the queen of wands for some of you you are tarot readers you are psychic mediums i see something to do with um hmm, spirituality here with the high priestess there's a real i'm not surprised again <laughs> with taurus you are very tuned in to your intuition i feel like you get messages yeah from your higher self from spirit from your angels from the universe whatever higher power you believe in but some of you have been guided to start spiritual businesses um and some of you are really following your intuition and your inner knowing with regards to what you're doing in work with the queen of wands you're really going through a period of taking action yeah queen of wands go getter fiery energy very ambitious at this time taurus i feel like um nothing is beyond your reach you're very much in control at this time and you're being seen in this light as well queen of wands energy very driven very passionate you come up as very attractive to a lot of people it could be at work at the moment you are very attractive you're being seen in this light um very sexy male or female i'm just throwing it out there this is what i'm being shown you are very very attractive at this time your ambition there's something around your your work and what you're doing people are absolutely viewing you as the prize at this time taurus okay so then you've got the devil card into the king of pentacles so for some of you you're absolutely obsessive over your work at this time building some of you are building a business yeah in whatever um in whatever area um what's the word i'm thinking of here whatever industry or sector it could be your own business again but i'm just getting this this real obsessiveness about creating your own wealth um and your own stability as well is what i'm getting here sorry there's a little fly um be mindful is also what i'll say because i feel like you may be this may be all encompassing for you yeah it's a massive focus at this time and i feel like spirit's just asking you to pay attention to that okay also you've got the page of pentacles and the hermit card so this is why i was laughing because again for the, <laughs> a lot of you are just focusing on yourself yeah i see with the hermit card you're going within you're looking at what life means to you at this time what makes you happy i see a lot of soul searching energy so i just get for a lot of you that you've gone ghost yeah 
you've gone hermit, you're focusing on yourself, yeah, looking for answers. And with this page of pentacles clarifying, I also get this sense that um, you're just giving little energy and effort to others at the moment. It's all about you. Mm, I'm picking it up very strongly. For some of you, you may also have a message coming in from a Virgo here. Page of Pentacles, the Hermit card. Okay. You have the, uh, the next cards out. You have the Chariot card with the Hanging Man and the Strength. So there's this fast moving action for you at this moment, Taurus. Fast moving. The Chariot is the fastest moving card in the deck. And I feel like what's changed for you is your perspective yeah the chariot card to the hanging man i feel like there's been some kind of a shift for you and whatever you're looking at from a different perspective now it's become your power it's become your strength there's a yeah there's absolutely a shift in your perspective and you use this to your advantage you're very strong at this time very courageous did you know what i feel this is i've just had a um mm, i've just had a download I feel like with the hanging man into the strength card, yeah, you've changed your perspective. You don't see things the same. You don't see life the same anymore. And I feel like people are viewing you in this light as well. It's all, <laughs> it's like, where's Taurus gone? This isn't Taurus. Taurus doesn't think like this. Taurus doesn't think out of the box with Taurus okay this is different this is the energy I'm getting you are not the same person anymore something has changed quite rapidly for you your mindset that's what I'm getting your mindset's not the same it is very strong and powerful at this time you've then got the seven of cups into the ten of cups in reverse hmm interesting there's something to do with people maybe wanting to offer you something at this time. There's a lot of opportunity surrounding you, Taurus. But I don't... There's something about relationships. Maybe the opportunities that are presenting themselves to you with regards to the Ten of Cups, a relationship dynamic, I feel like it either hasn't been successful for you in the past or you're not entertaining them. There's something here about the opportunities, whether it's in family matters, um, you know, relationships with a partner, sexual connections. Maybe you're just taking a long time to figure out what relationships you want to have with people. And maybe again, closing out relationships that aren't serving you. Yeah, okay. Interesting energy for you right now. I feel it's all about you and it's all about work. I'll be I'll be honest. Right, you've then got the Ace of Swords into the Four of Cups. There might be for some of you some kind of clarity headed your way here. Some kind of information. But I feel like you're not interested in hearing it. You might intuitively know what this is. This could be people wanting to bring you some kind of truths. But I see you disinterested at this time. Again, maybe because your focus is elsewhere. But there's something to do with a breakthrough or some kind of um, hmm, information headed your way. For others of you, I'll be honest, there's also something here about new opportunities. New opportunities trying to come in for you. But your focus is elsewhere. So some of you aren't seeing what's... Hmm, some of you aren't seeing what's around the corner or you're not focused on it okay then with the hierophant card into the six of cups here i do feel like you're showing up as a leader you're showing up as a very spiritual some of you are spiritual teachers some of you are again teachers there's a highly influential aspect of you here people look up to you you could give some kind of guidance again some kind of counsel to others but you you really do come across as a high profile figure in society at this time and you're looked up to very much so 
you could have people from your past here with the six of cups um recognizing this about you or noticing this about you now this may have been how you always came came across to others um and there's some kind of nostalgic memories that others are feeling about you with regards to your demeanor your ability to give good advice to mentor to counsel your authority that's what i'm getting but it's not authority in in the sense of power and control taurus it's authority in terms of being the go-to person to give sound advice mm, that's nice it's nice energy here okay last couple of cards again this is <laughs> this is what i i thought was coming out for you and what i expected you've got the queen of pentacles to the seven of pentacles absolutely about your business at the moment king of pentacles here queen of pentacles here seven of pentacles here eight of pentacles it's all about work it's all about building wealth building your money saving investing i see at this time that's all you've got time for right now you the book the card at the bottom of the deck for you was the queen of swords as well i feel like anything that isn't to do with your money and serving your highest good you're cutting off you have no time for it yeah life is short and you're all about building. Interestingly enough, the card underneath the Queen of Swords is the Three of Swords. So I feel a lot of people are maybe heartbroken at this time, Taurus. Maybe heartbroken by the energy you're embodying at the moment. A lot of you have cut situations off. A lot of you have cut people off. For whatever reason, take it as it resonates for you. But you have people in their feelings for you at this time okay so that's all i have for you today i hope it's resonated i was only meant to do a short reading but there was actually um yeah a lot came out but again i hope it resonates with you in some way shape or form if it does hit that like button subscribe and i'll see you back in another video namaste